Hi y'all, this is so so blessed. Welcome back to the blessed place. How y'all doing? One more again. <laughs> Just before I go to bed, I wanted to stop by and um, share with you all my Valentine's Day and to ask you to share your Valentine's Day with me. What did you do? Where did you go? Did you get anything? Um, do you not celebrate it? Um, were you pleasantly surprised? Were you disappointed? And be honest. It's okay to say I was disappointed. And it's okay to say I don't get into the commercialism of all that. And it's okay to say I was pleasantly surprised. But I want to share with you all. Well, first of all, my day started out. I got up about 9 o'clock this morning, used the bathroom, took a shower, um, got back in bed watched TV for about 20-30 minutes and I fell asleep. Y'all, I slept almost all day. I slept till 3.30. I must have been tired from working and not getting much sleep all week long. And I was more tired than I must have realized. So uh, about 3.30, my husband called me. He was out working and he called me and he asked me to put him some corn dogs in the oven. So y'all, I cooked him a corn dog valentine meal. And when he came home, he gave me a beautiful red bag. And he, as he handed me um, the bag, he says, Baby, I'm not rich anymore. And this is all I could afford. And when I opened up the bag, he had a whole lot of smell good stuff for me. Lotion, body wash, because he knows that's what I like to shower in. And he got me this, y'all. Let me see. When it come across on camera, this is a book by Steve Harvey, and it's called. Let's see if you can see it. I never navigate these cameras. Act like a act like a lady, but think like a man. It's terrible. Why can't you get this stuff on camera? Anyways, um, there it is. Act like a lady, but think like a man. And he heard me mention that I wanted this book. And he went out and got it. And then he got me one of my favorite singers, India Ari. Uh, if you've never heard of her or if you've never listened to her music, she has some beautiful soul-stirring music. I love her, her, I love her, vo her voice and the tone of her voice. And I love her lyrics. So, um... That was just so awesome. And like I said, my husband said, you know, he's not rich and this was all he could afford. And I'm like, honey, you rich in love, rich in faith, rich in God's amazing grace. You're getting richer and richer every day. <laughs> Anyways, y'all. But... Um, we did go to dinner. We went to dinner, and we had a very, very nice dinner. Um, we did have corn dogs a little earlier, <clears throat> but about I think eight o'clock tonight we went to dinner, and we had a wonderful time. So I had a blessed Thanksgiving, very pleasantly surprised because I hadn't anticipated getting anything because money tight, y'all, and I had not anticipated getting anything. But that was just so beautiful and so thoughtful. That he remembered, you know, the things I just mentioned one day that, oh, Indiari has a new city out, you know, I've got to get that city. And then I mentioned, oh, I saw Steve Harvey on an interview on CNN. And he has a new book. Oh, I got a new book. So he listens. Oh, my God. That's the best Valentine's Day you can have. It's a man that listens to you. Um, Y'all see, I got all this gray in my hair. Oh my goodness, I got to get this gray out of my hair. I tried to get in to see my beautician, but she was booked. I mean, I called her on a Wednesday, and she told me she was booked until the next Wednesday. So, I got to get my hair done. I got to get it fried, dyed, and laid to the side. I'm going to get that done next week. So, um... I had to look like this for Valentine. <laughs> Anyways. <clears throat> well, I hope y'all had a blessed day. Please share your Valentine's Day with me. Um, and I will talk to y'all later. Y'all be blessed.